Part four. I almost put two parts together into one there, but I, I want to keep them separate so that you can just dive in and watch a short video for these parts. So, part four, tutorial 20. We've done comprehensive lockdown. There it is on the screen. Now we want to do the absolute antonym of this. And I was alluding to this at the end of part three there. How could we do that? Well, let's copy total lockdown to wide open dot show. And if we vi wide open, how could we change this? Well, once again, we're going to flush the tables. And perhaps some of you already know, some of you have guessed, you just change drop. To accept. And if we change this, you can see why I'm doing it in scripts now. Before I hit return, all we've done is change drop to accept. If we now run wide open, remember currently we are closed to everything. In fact, let's just run total again and do an IP tables minus L. Our policy is to drop everything. Now we're going to run wide open and do an IP tables minus L and our policy is to accept everything. Well, if we're accepting everything, can we ping IPT CLT1 on its private? Of course we can. It's wide open. And it's public. Yep. Client 2 on its public. Yep. And client 2 on its private. Of course we can, because the machine's wide open. Let's just run total again. Total lockdown. Let's go through these pings again. Client 1. Not even permitted. So there you go. We've now very quickly got two scripts which allow us to have total lockdown and the absolute antonym or opposite of that, the wide open. So I've got two scripts in there, wide open and total lockdown. In fact, I've been silly there and I want to move both of those into the directory I created for it. I was far too quick in doing that. And I want to keep everything in scripts. So there's our two scripts. That's the end of part four. It was that simple. We've created the two ends of the spectrum. We're now going to continue building on total lockdown. So join me in part five when we'll do something a little bit more precise rather than the blunt instrument that we have at the moment. And the blunt instruments we have are nothing and everything. So now we're going to start covering the grey area in between those. And in part four, we're going to cover ping and allowing ping from selective number of hosts.